Hey everybody! It's been... I don't even know how long. Kind of shameful. The only reason why I'm able to film today is because it looks like this outside. And everybody's panicking about some massive superstorm that never actually happened, so right now I'm stuck at home and I'm just grateful that I have the day off. Now, some of you might be thinking, hey, you actually look pretty good for someone who's going to be staying home and doing nothing all day. And the only reason why I'm doing nothing is because I finally got my work done and I was able to do this. Let me just clarify one thing for you. I'm only trying from the neck up. I realized my entire outfit is composed of one color. I feel like I could be a superhero. It's like I changed out of my pajamas just to put my pajamas back on. I'm getting kind of off topic here. I had quarterly exams this past week, and I have quarterly exams because my school no longer does midterms and finals like literally everywhere else in the country. And I figured, since I complained about this at about the same time last year, it's high time that I complain about it again. So it's time to whine about how hard school is. I just want to point one thing out for everybody. This year's junior year of high school, which is notorious for being the most difficult year there is, and I'm also in two AP classes and two honors classes and I had to drop to like average level for everything else because I just can't handle everything. And even then I'm still having a hard time. Because as I said in probably one of my videos, I can't remember which one specifically, if I don't take the hardest classes available, I feel like I'm being lazy and not living up to my own potential even though at this point in my life I don't even know what my potential is because I'm having such a hard time with everything. I just take the hardest classes because I know that the people there care about their work as much as I do, and it's something challenging enough for me not to get bored, but then the pressure kicks in and then I have to get things done and then everything just sort of just... You think you can do these things, but you just can't, Nemo! I should stop quoting Disney movies. The thing about my school is the AP kids look forward to testing week, unlike everyone else, because during testing week, you don't get homework because you have to study. And in my case, I had homework spilling over from previous weeks into testing week that were due after testing week. So in addition to studying everything, I had to get a shitload of work done. I'm going to censor that because my family watches my YouTube videos and I shouldn't swear in their faces. This past marking period, I've had B's in almost everything. And I'm pretty sure this is a new low for me, other than when I was in middle school and I had the worst math teacher on the planet for three years straight. Anyway, this massive workload is the reason why I haven't made a video in over a month. I shot the one at the park on December 27th, and then I didn't put it on my channel for, like, I don't even know. I can't remember. I'm gonna have to check the date on that. So it's not really because I've been lazy. It's because I've had to be selectively lazy. I just really don't like the way that my classes force me to prioritize the things that I really, really want to do and sort of just put everything on the back burner so I can focus on my classes. And I was supposed to take the ACTs and the SATs this year, but I just never signed up for them until like last week because I've been so swamped with work that I couldn't just find a day to sit down for the half hour to put the information in and sign up for everything. And now I have to study for those in addition to everything else, and I've developed a habit of rubbing my face out of stress because it's some kind of tick or like triggered response. I don't know, but I don't like it, and I've been doing it like every single day. So that's what the state of my life is right now. I'm glad that I got to complain to you people and forced you to sit here and listen to me until the end of this video. I really thought I would have something else to say, but no, that was it. And I'm also annoyed with life because all the red has washed out of my hair and now it's this really annoying, like, undecided peach-orange color and I've decided that I'm just going to bleach it until it turns into pillow stuffing and falls out. Here is this rendition of Midterm Suck, part two, I guess. I'll see you whenever I'm no longer drowning under research and typing. And whatever else my classes need me to do. Bye. That was a terrible ending.